Quantum entanglement. Essentially, quantum entanglement explains how the fate of a particle in a subatomic experiment can instantaneously affect another particle on the complete opposite side of the universe. It's sort of like how if you take a pair of socks, put one sock on your left foot, the other sock instantly becomes the right sock, no matter where it's located in the universe. This is not exactly the easiest of quantum-based theories to simplify, but let's give it a go. When any two quantum objects, like a photon or an electron, end up coming into contact with one another, their quantum states, which is basically all the mathematical information that describes their specific properties, combine or entangle. From that point on, their fates are intertwined, no matter how far apart they are in the future. Okay, so maybe this part doesn't seem too strange. I mean, it's easy to see how two entities that have shared interactions in the past could result in a lasting effect or change to one another in some capacity. Well, this effect created by the interaction can still be seen when we view the particles afterward. The only thing is, quantum entanglement theory gets a bit weirder than that. Inside the quantum world, an entity can present two or more conflicting properties at the same time. For instance, spinning in opposite directions simultaneously. This is what is known as superposition. So let's say a photon becomes entangled with another photon. Then it can infect it with its own superposition, so that they're now both in superpositions. I know. That's a lot of superpositions. Well, when we go and look at one of them, which is technically a form of measurement, the photon is now forced to choose which way it's spinning. And now because it is entangled, we are also forcing the other photon to decide. It doesn't matter how far apart the photons are, this still happens instantly. The theory of quantum entanglement is so much more than a stack of theoretical waffle. It's actually forming the foundations for a range of useful technologies like quantum computing, cryptography, and even teleportation. Despite all this, we'll forgive you if you're not fully behind the theory. Ultimately, the way in which quantum entanglement is explained will depend greatly on the interpretation of quantum mechanics that you agree with. And there are a lot of them. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked the video and you want to see more just like it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button.